trying to encourage you with this. I'm trying to give you something to hold, a principle that will change a life. Your success is not tied to what is in your bank account. It's not to, tied to what is um, associated with your family name or what your degrees are. Your success is directly tied to your God. He rises and falls in man. And the man that stays with him, that believes him, that has faith in him, takes care of you. He will bring those promises to fruition. And you will see the um, you will see what they bear played out in your life. Abraham had the down payment. He had the son born of him. But he had to drive that away month by month, those doubts that came by. But he saw. And just like he did, you will. And just like I have on the little things, I'm going to on the large things. Why? Because my God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. He is faithful and true. What he speaks, it's like silver refined in a furnace seven times. It's pure. And it can be held on to, believed, and trusted because my God cannot lie. If he spoke to me, he's already seen it. He's just telling me I'm about to walk into it. So hold on to it. Drive anything else away. Don't get distracted by the worries of this life, by the shiny things of this life, by the vultures that come your way. Drive them all back because I seen where you were at and that's where I need you to be. And the same is true for you. Drive those doubts, those fears away you hold on to your God, to the promises thereof, to what he speaks, to what he has put in your heart, to the name of Jesus, and you see if he don't come with that fire and that smoke. And when he does, and when he does, you worship him. You give him glory. Don't you dare take it for yourself. Don't you forget God when you eat well. Don't you forget God when you live in the land and have all the prosperity of your life. Don't you forget God when the promises come to pass and the children come back home. Don't you forget God because it's only by his promise that it came in the first place. You worship God. You thank God. You honor God. You glorify God. You magnify God. You elevate God. And you give him everything. Because he deserves it all.